Hi brothers and sisters in Christ. In this video I'm going to be talking to you about an amazing supernatural experience that I experienced with angels and how I, like my encounter with angels. But before I do, I want to encourage you guys, if you're not a Christian, please look in the comment section of this video because in the comment section, uh, I always upload a long comment that has a bunch of evidence for Christianity. So if you want evidence as to why Christianity is true, please read that comment. And if you are a Christian, please spread that comment. Now, getting on to the supernatural experience. Um, in the past, um, God has revealed himself to me and he gave me like supernatural revelation, like dreams and stuff. And this experience that I had with angels, it was a, it was a little bit different than that. Because in the past, when God gave me supernatural revelation, and I'll include a link to some other testimonies of how I saw God, I'll include a link to those in the description box of this video, so if you guys want to check that out. So in the past, when God gave me supernatural revelation, and what, when He showed me like scenes and events where He showed me Jesus Christ even on a cross, I pretty much didn't have free will. I was pretty much there, God gave me the vision, and the vision was over. So it was, it was pretty quick. And I didn't have free will. I could, I, I pretty much all I could do is I could see what God was revealing Himself to me. I couldn't really talk back or answer back, and I didn't have free will. But in this experience, in this supernatural experience, I was in the spirit, and I, I saw this light, like it was kind of like a tunnel, and there was just like the circle of light, and at the end, I could see beings, but. It wasn't really clear. They kind of looked pretty far away from me. So I could see them, but I couldn't really tell tell like their facial features or what they were wearing. I couldn't really tell that much. It wasn't clear. But what was interesting about the supernatural experience is that I had free will. I was like asking questions and they were responding back to me. And I don't know how I know this, but I knew they were angels and I was communi communicating with angels. And... I don't really remember what I was asking them, but I do remember a question I asked them at the end and what they responded. So I'll be getting it into that in the in the later part of this video. But this was this was a very interesting supernatural experience. Like for the first time that um for the first time I was speaking with angels and I, I prayed about this in the past that I'm like, God, please let me just speak with angels. Let me just speak with angels just once. And in the past I didn't really get much revelation on that but on this one i mean my spirit i was in the spirit and i could see that tunnel of light and i was communicating with them and what was interesting about this is that when i was communicating with them i knew i was communicating with them but when they responded back i couldn't really hear their audible voice but when they used to communicate with me when they were communicating with me in the experience everything there they were saying i could feel in my spirit so I didn't need ears to hear them because they would just communicate with me and whatever they were saying it would just it would just straight up go to my mind and I knew what they were saying and I put I it's like I think it's called telekinesis like it was something like that to say the least but when I was speaking with them I wasn't like sending thoughts to them with my mind I was speaking with them but when they responded like I just felt in my spirit what they were saying and it was so interesting. So this experience was happening, right? But during the experience, like I said, I had free will to ask questions and things like that. But even during the experience, for some reason, I was faithless. I, I'm like, is this really happening? Or I can't believe this is happening. And at the end, I'm like, okay, let me see if this is really happening. So I try to test the angels. I'm like, okay, if this is really happening, come over here. I want to give you a hug. I want to know if you guys are real. But then they pretty much caught on to my tricks because they, they pretty much probably saw that I was being faithless. And the only reason I was saying, come over here, let me give them a hug. Not because like I wanted to give them a hug, but because I, I was trying to see if they were really real. And they and I, I got a response like um, we something like we can't do that and we have rules. And so they pretty much caught on to what I was trying to do, right? I was, I was pretty much being faithless. And I know I've been guilty of that in the past before too. And 
shame on me because even during that experience in some parts of it i didn't really believe that it was happening and now that i think about it i just feel bad and i put him up to the test i'm like come over here i want to give you a hug so i can see if they're real and they said something like we have rules and you have to respect our rules so i guess during the experience is that they were allowed to do some things and say some things but they weren't really allowed to come and give me a hug or things like that. So I, I got something about rules and respecting rules and how I should respect their rules because they respect my rules. That's, that's pretty much what I got. So um, this is what I wanted to talk to you guys about. Thank you for listening. All glory to God and God bless.